Tales of Robin Hood by Holly Noel, age 7, Josiah, age 11, and Mommy, age 11. Um, um, this Briar Tuck, Little John, Maid Miriam, Mama, and Prince John. Um, this is Robin Hood, this is King Richard, these are the arrows, and this is the sheriff. Show, show Robin King. Hood again. Robin Hood. Hold up here. I hope, we hope you, you enjoy our, our shadow puppet, puppet film. There once was a friendly man who is named Robin Hood. I, I steal from the sheriff of Nottingham and give money to the poor. This made him have to live in hiding. Here in Sherwood Forest, Robin Hood gathered a band of merry men who joined him. Little John and Friar Tuck were among them. The men heard of an archery tournament hosted by the mean Prince John. So they all gather disguises to go to the tournament with hopes of winning the golden arrow and made Marion as his wife. At the tournament, everyone in the competition gathers and takes turns firing their arrows. Shoot them. Shoot them. When it is Robin Hood's turn, he hits the very center of the target Shoot them. and wins the tournament and the crowd cheers. Huzzah! Huzzah! But, when Robin Hood goes to receive his prize, Maid Marion and the Golden Arrow, the sheriff realizes he is Robin Hood and chases him and his band out of Nottingham. Right. Then the sheriff and Robin have a big fight. Soon, Robin Hood defeats the sheriff by shoving him off a bridge. <laughs> Allowing them all to escape. And on his way out, Robin Hood scoops up Ma Maid Marian while on his steed along with the golden arrow and retreats back to Sherwood Forest to live happily ever after. Later, King Richard finds Robin Hood in Sherwood Forest. You are no longer an outlaw, Robin Hood. I am back as the rightful king. Thank you, King Richard. I serve you with honor. Come, live in my palace. Back at the castle, Prince John is huddled in a corner of a cell. Mama. The end.